In the previous video lesson, we discussed about the use of variables in common rules, especially we discussed in the previous lesson about this uh, rules of geometry and now we're going to talk about the rules of arithmetic, okay? So these rules of geometry I have further divided into the two part, commutativity and distributivity, okay? Uh, and one more thing, this commutativity can be divided further into the two part based on the variables. Actually, we're talking about the, uh, you know, uh, the variables, how we can generalize the, the big, big problems of arithmetic uh, into, the, uh, into the algebra, okay? So that algebraic expression uh, can easily solve the big problems. We're trying to generalize the things, okay? So uh, we can again further divide this commutativity based on addition of two variables and multiplication of two variables. Okay, so let's talk for a while addition of and, and multiplication of two variables. Let me let me go to the arithmetic. Okay, uh, let's talk about the addition of two numbers. Let's say I'm going to add three and five. Okay, uh, that is going to be eight. What if I add five plus three? That is going to be again eight. Now. Let's try to understand the, the word first. Commutativity is actually uh, the word that we made from commuting, you know. Commuting. And what is the meaning of commuting? That means interchanging, okay. Interchanging. So, when we interchange the number, you know, 3 plus 5 or 5 plus 3, both are same. 3 plus 5 or 5 plus 3, you know. That gives the same result in arithmetic, all right? That's why I told you this is the rules of arithmetic. So we're gonna generalize that thing, okay? So if a number, let's say this three, you know, this three can be anything. For a while it's three, but it can be any number. And this five can be any number, okay? 100, 300, 500, any, any number, doesn't matter, okay? So in that case, A plus B can be same as b plus a. Here a and b both are variables. Keep in mind, okay? These both are variables. Means these numbers value will change or, or we can change that to anything, okay? So, so I mean to say 8 plus 3 is equals to 3 plus 8. I'm going to say 11 plus 9 is equals to 9 plus 11. It's same, okay? So we are just generalizing the addition of the addition of two numbers okay and now we can say that two numbers as a variable so when it goes as a variables it generalizes the whole rules okay so so no matter you know you can you can add like 8 9 5 4 3 6 blah 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 with 2 4 5 6 and 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 and, and this will be same if you if you do that 2 4 5 6 plus what is this oh my god copy and paste <laughs> okay Okay, not like that. I can copy like this. Copy and paste and paste. Okay, <laughs> too smart boy, huh? <laughs> All right, so I'm just saying that you can interchange the numbers, you can interchange the variables, and when you when you can uh, write any arithmetic rules in the form of variables, that that simplifies the thing. You know, now you might not be understanding. Um, uh, what is this? You know, something like that. But later you will see how, how, how these things is going to make you very, very easy to solve the big problems, okay? Right, now let's talk about the multiplication, right? So, multiplication. Same rules, okay? We can interchange the positions. I'm going to say 3 times 5 is 15, right? And similarly, 5 times 3 is 15, okay? So it looks same, you know, 3 times 5 is equals to 5 times 3. Then in the form of variables, let's say a and b are the two variables representing two different number. a times b is same as b times a, okay? And these a and b can be anything, okay? This is a rule now. This is a generalization form, you know, the generalized form of arithmetic. So it can be uh, 3 times 2 equals to 2 times 3 or it can be 8 times 9 equals to 9 times 8. It is not just for the 3 and 5, okay? It is for the 3, 2. It is for the 8, 9. For any number, for any digit, okay? That's what I'm trying to say. That's what I'm generalizing here, okay? So, in, in, in arithmetic also, algebra plays a very, very great role and so does it will help in our real life, okay? Later on, all right? So, uh, see. Algebra is very powerful, all right, my friend. So now in the next presentation, we'll talk more about the algebraic uh, uh, expression. We'll probably try to solve some exercise, 
all right and then we'll go to the next lesson bye bye yeah 3 plus 4 is 7 and this 5 is as it is okay now 3 plus 9 that is 12 and 7 plus 5 is 12 Ooh, voila it's not changing right this is what is associative rule, associ associativity, okay? And now let me go with some numbers.